folks. My next guest plays Laura on Family Matters, which means week after week she is shamelessly pursued by perhaps uh, the most amazing individual on the planet. <laughs> oh, I think I'm in love. Please, here's a look. So what's up with you and Gary? Nothing. <laughs> we had a long talk on the plane, and it looks like we got a lot in common. Well, don't commit too soon. This place is jammed with good-looking guys. Well, I can't imagine finding a more perfect guy than Gary. Ooh, maybe that's Mr. Perfect now. Howdy, do you my cutie? Urkel! Please welcome Kelly Williams! Kelly Williams! Lovely to see you. Thank you. That guy. Yeah. Urkel. Weird, huh? Unbelievable. Yeah. You have the toughest job in show business. I, uh, yeah. Keeping up with that guy. <laughs> How many years has that been now? Six. And he started out kind of Urkelish. Right. I saw him on a show. He's like 6'4 now. Right. And you, you ask him a question, oh, uh, yes, but it's, you know, it's a whole I know, it's so now. hard for him to keep the voice together. Absolutely. Yeah. So is he gonna, are you guys maybe gonna get married? Oh, no. <laughs> Not at all. Okay. No. Well, that's, uh, uh, it seems like with him knocking things over all the time, it's a bit dangerous out there. Right. Working on the set. Are you? Oh, no, I that? stand back. Yeah. Yeah, I just shake my head. That's my part. We're reactors. Oh, that's I see. That's what we call ourselves. Oh, that boy. Yeah. <laughs> just practice right, that. Right, we stand back. Right? Yeah, so you never get hurt on the set or anything right. like oh, that. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I think that's, I think that's a good thing. Uh, you're kind of uh, the no-nonsense girl right. on the show, mm -hmm. which is nice. Are you that way uh, in, in real life? Yeah. Oh, yes. That's real? one of my New Year's resolutions. What is your New Year's resolution? Not to be so harsh. I, really, you seem lovely to me. I don't, I don't oh, see the harshness. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, I'm a lot like my mother. You know, no, well, no she's nonsense. She's lovely as well, from what I understand. Right, right. I don't, I don't know your mom. <laughs> yeah, but, um, you know, when I have something to say, I just say it. I don't... You know, back down. Back down. I just like, like, for instance, if, I if you were to say, sweater, I said that was the grossest sweater I ever seen in my life. No, really? I'm not saying that. Really, I like your sweater. <laughs> what What about the beard? Do you think the beard sucks, or uh, you know? Oh uh, yeah, that's mm-hmm, that's nice. <laughs> what? Nothing. No, I feel bad no, about no, that. No, no, I like goatees. Do you really? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. I'm really on the cutting edge, you know, having this. Oh. I'm like four years behind the trend. <laughs> Like five years from now, I'll probably get my nipple pierced or something. You know, you know, I'm an idiot with that stuff. Uh, but you, you're, you're in shape now. You're, you're working out like a, a well, fiend. Well, I'm not all the way in shape, but I'm working out. Are you really? What yes. do, what's your uh, regimen? Well, sometimes working out, kind of. All right, you're not, not working all out at all, time. are you? Yeah. Perhaps we can jazzercise together sometime. <laughs> I would Oops. like that very much. No, yeah. Uh, have you had to overcome, like, uh, to, to be on this hit show and have all the public after you? I imagine uh, you were kind of shy in the beginning. Right. And not, uh... Yeah, no, actually, my, I was... I was really shy when I was like four years old. I didn't talk to anyone except for my grandmother. Sure. And my parents just started getting worried, like, what's wrong with that girl? So they put me into theater classes to bring me out. So what was your first theater role? Um, oh, actually, it was um, the, the salute, first salute to Martin Luther King with Debbie Allen. So that was exciting. You mean th your first role was actually on TV with the whole thing? Mm-hmm. Whatever happened to, like, I played a tree? I mean, whatever <laughs> happened to you, ju you jumped right out there, and it's like my first role was as Esther Williams in the Esther Williams story. I mean, right. But that's an amazing experience. She's a, right. a pretty incredible woman. Did she yeah. choreograph you, do a little dancing? Yes, her and Michael Peters. Wow. Yeah. She started out actually. So it was exciting. Right, doing the dancing and things like mm -hmm. that. Did you, they make you do commercials and things? Or? Oh, yeah. She, like, I did like a lot of local commercials, like insurance commercials. It looked like, I don't know, maybe they thought I was going to be like some kind of beat up kid or something, but I did right. a lot of. Insurance commercial, like. Mm -hmm. They would drag you in and go, seriously, you need protection. Right, right. That can be a little rough. What's going to happen coming up? Is this, is this show over now, or is this, how much longer is... Uh... We don't know. We don't know how long we can fit them in those pants, so... Is that the key to the show? Did, and do you have any idea when this thing started that, you know... We never, we never knew the show was going to do as well as it did. Right, because now it's, it's also, besides being a top-rated show, it's a top-rated show in syndication or something. Yeah, it's doing really well in syndication. We come on like 20 times a day. Right. So... And you know what's weird? I catch every single episode. Really? I never miss it. Thank you. He drives me crazy. Ooh. He comes in and the pants Ooh. are high and he makes Th the noise. Oh. And did I do that? Oh. What drives me crazy? Okay. Absolutely. All righty then. Are you doing now? Are you living with the, the syndication money? Are you going out and you're buying houses and horses and castles? And no, I, 
afford a, a little condo. My parents are my parents are really conservative. They're like, no, you don't need this, you know. Right. So I'm just doing the She's regular protecting thing. protecting the money. Where's right. the condo? Is it in New York, LA? Um, Los Angeles. Very nice. West Hollywood. I'll be out there in a week. Oh, goody. You can visit me. Is it me. two bedroom, three bedroom? Oh, oh no, I have roommates, sorry. Oh, that's fine. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh what do I care? I got things to do. And, and so uh, what is your New Year's uh, going to be? You're going to go back to Los Angeles for New Year's and hang out with your uh, friends? Yeah, what, I'm, what am I going to do? Yeah. Um, go to Disneyland. And they didn't pay me to say that, so. You're really going to Disneyland? Yeah, it's nice. Oh, sure. No, really? Absolutely. With it, my friends. It's, uh, from what I understand, the happiest place on earth. Mm, right. Uh, have you been there before? Yeah, I'm just trying to make this like a New Year's thing every year. Go to Disneyland and watch the fireworks with all the kitties and stuff. Right. Yeah. Now it's cool. If you get to be like 60 or 70, it would probably be creepy. <laughs> you know what I mean? You'd be like. Yeah, weird. Yeah, the old lady with the big baggy coat. And, and the whole thing, yeah. But this year, I think it would be a nice thing to do. Yeah. Maybe I'll join you down there. Oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> no, I like you, really. <laughs> You're my favorite friend. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess we can expect a restraining order very soon. <laughs> so tell us when Family Matters is on. It's on, um... Uh, All right. Um, <laughs> It's on Friday night. Uh, when you see me next on the show, I'll have a different sweater and no beard, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's part of that TGI Friday lineup. Oh, don't miss that. <laughs> My thanks to Kelly. <laughs> we'll be right back after this. Stick around. We'll come back. the Proclaimers in the audience tonight. <laughs> there they are. Beautiful. I would walk 500 miles. All right. I'm here with uh, Kelly Williams uh, from Family Matters. Thank you so much for coming by. Thanks for having you me. You have a lovely New Year's. I love your sweater. I love oh, your beard or whatever you so that much. thing is. Oh, stop. Nice. You're loving me. By the way, Monday show, Robert Klein, Montel Williams, and music from Ice-T and Body Count. So check that one out. Uh, it's been a pleasure. Thanks. Who else was on the show tonight? Do you remember? Dick Clark. Dick Clark. Woo! Check him out. New Year's Rock and Eve. Dick Clark was here. Henry Thomas was here. Kelly Williams, of course, was here. And uh, say hello to everybody at the set of Family Matters and okay, Urkel. Well, all right. And all the Urkelettes. You love him, don't you? I love him very much. I can tell. Uh, I dress ooh, like ooh. Oh, I can tell. <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen, Pop Will Eat Itself. They're going to play us out. Happy New Year, everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs>